This is a variation of Nick Mueller's dovetail alignment jig that I made pretty much entirely with hand tools because I don't have a functioning mill right now. Um, so this starts with a uh, half inch ground dowel that I brazed onto this uh, piece of um, flat stock. And I did use my friend's drill press to bore some holes in those. The holes here are designed so that they fit in the um, cross holes in a one, two, three block. And that gives you a um, vertical height adjustment here. And this is a uh, 3 8 rod that I gave a little bit of a polish to and I threaded the end and that threads into the um, threaded holes in the block and that's designed to fit the uh, um, uh, this uh, mounting block for my sterid, um uh, surface gauge. So this is the mill uh, off, this is a knee off my uh, grizzly mill. And this is leveled against this uh, cast iron surface plate. And, and this is, this is not the most accurate thing in the world, but I'm just using this for demonstration purposes. But this is a, a cast iron surface plate that's part of my workbench. And this is a, a steroid, believe it or not, this is a steroid 199 vial. It's in a 99 um, uh, level, but it's a 199 vial, so that is a uh, five tenths per foot um, per division. So I aligned the knee with this uh, level here, and then I'm using a precision straight uh, precision square on here. So the alignment jig fits in the dovetails here, and the um, one, two, three block gives it the correct height. So if you slide this in here, like so. Mm, okay. And uh, you really, really do need to use uh, both hands, but I'm just using one hand here because I have the phone in my other hand. So that lines up with that hole. And then if we look here, let me, okay. So it's zero on top. And uh, all over the fricking place. And it's just a mess on the bottom. So it's 15 thousandths off in eight inches. Going, oops, going back to zero. And that pretty much exactly matches uh, 15 thousandths over eight inches. That exactly matches my previous reading that I took with the knee um, in the mill. So this measurement confirms my previous measurement and that these dovetails are completely jacked. I mean, if you look in here, these things, they, they look like they were cut with a freaking ax. Um, I mean, they're bad. So I guess it was a good thing that I did end up pulling um, the knee off, uh, but, um, yeah, so that's basically uh, where I am with uh, fixing this wreck.